this is how you uh, start up to be a door dasher. You got to go to the App Store, the Play 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 Store, and you download the app for free. Look under DoorDash. Now this one is to order food with. This one that says Dasher with a little bag is the one to work with if you want to be a door dasher. Mine has a sign in, so but as you can see, the map's not lit up and um reds, pinks, grays, whatever, because mine's not activated completely yet. Okay. Now you can the schedule, see you can't do schedule yet, but you pick your days of schedule. Um, I personally think it's probably easier just to dip in there and just hit dash now instead of do a schedule. Um, but that's my own personal opinion. Uh, and as far as the schedule, you, um, uh, on your schedule thing, you, uh, um, you can't go longer like extend your shift you get like one shift a day so you want to make a real long shift and if you want to quit your shift early then you just quit early um, don't take your breaks longer than 30 minutes because it'll say pause for your time and if you go longer than 30 minutes it just clock you out so make it you know if you're gonna if you think we have just work a couple hours well book it for five hours and then that way you can stay later if you want on that five hours. Um, if not, and you know, if you don't want to stay the total five hours and then clock out. But don't try to extend it after the five hours because it's not going to let you do it. Anyway, um, you get your current week earnings. And if you want to get the fast pay, um, it lets you transfer your earnings from your bank account um, once a day. For a deduction rate like two or three bucks on there and then if you want to get the fast pay uh, you can't get it for two weeks basically and after you do at least 25 deliveries so that's how that works okay and then you get your ratings average customer rating acceptance rate completion rate time or early total lifetime deliveries and then you got your account details when you get your red card if you go to orientation or if you don't have orientation they just mail it to you um, with your bag and you can order extra red cards for free at the store at the dash store um, and they ship it free too so i ordered the extra card just in case um and then you enter your card number and set the card and it's ready and that's what you use to pay some of your merchants um, most of them are already paid online. Settings. Leave it on Google Maps. And then I use a GPS um, on my car. Um, which works better than that. Um, and then of course log out. You just want to leave it logged in. So anyway, that's how you do it. Um, when you go to the app... when you first open the app you have to um, uh, you download your app at the app store and then you open the app up and it says want to be a dasher and then you put in your email address and um, they'll send you an email and it instructs you what to do and they send you little emails for several days, and um, you'll you'll get up, and all of a sudden the app will start having a map on it, but it's not a lit up map with the red and the gray areas and all that junk. Um, it just kind of gets more and more every day. They'll send you emails so they can do a background check on you um, to see your driving record and stuff, and um, that's really quick, um, and you'll get it. You'll get two emails for your background check. One that says it's here, and the next one's actually a printed out one. And um, you can read it yourself and see what it says. And it'll say clear, 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 clear. And then you're approved. Um, and then uh, 
uh, it, um, uh, they'll send you another message of where do you want us to send your um, starter kit, and you can put that at a different address if you want. Um, I have P.O. Boxes, so all my mail goes to P.O. Boxes around the states. Um, it'll tell you to sign your, your bank account up. Um, I uh, I did that, and so it'd be ready by the time I got my stuff. And um, other than that, it's probably about a week before you actually start working. Um, because you got to wait and try to do your thing before the weekend. Um, I did mine <laughs> near the weekend, so it's probably going to take time. And um, uh, it takes probably about four days. They say it takes like up to 12 days to get your starter kit, but I'd say it's probably about four days. And um, anyway, that's how you kind of get started. So uh, sign up for DoorDash, and um, you get bonuses if you sign up friends. You can text them and stuff through the app. Um, other than that, enjoy.